It was a big day at the Alexandria Police Department. Standing room only for their latest graduation ceremony. Complete with speeches, plaques, and lots of celebration. But this ceremony then moved outside so folks could meet the newest member of the department. I'm really excited for Zara when we first got her. I didn't think we'd get to this point. <laughs> Zara is certainly an unlikely recruit. She's a shelter dog, surrendered more than a year ago to the Animal Welfare League of Alexandria by owners who didn't feel she was a good match for their activity level. We quickly realized that she was extremely high energy. She was not a dog for the average family in any way. And we knew, as a Belgian Malinois especially, that she was going to need a placement where she had uh, a lot of work to do, keep her mind stimulated for her to be really happy and uh, content. So they reached out to the police department, who recognized this pooch had some great qualities, like her speed, drive, and energy. They decided and, uh, to give her a what chance. Do you know about Zara was accepted into the basic canine school. It's clear. And began 14 intense weeks of training in agility, searching, apprehension, and obedience. She was not very well behaved in the beginning, according to the Escobar family with whom she now lives. She was really hyper. I mean, it was having like a new child all over again, you know, one that needed to be trained. Luckily, she was potty trained, but she tore into everything. But she learned and excelled, and today Zara graduated from the Alexandria Police Department's basic canine school. Now she is officially Steven Escobar's partner. It was a pleasure to see her picking things up and doing things well. But like I said, she's still very headstrong and we're still going to keep training and try to get some of the quirks out, like her obedience, working on that. So she's a rookie? Yeah, she's a rookie. You know, like with an officer just coming off the streets, you know. He's not going to know everything, but they're going to learn. We're a team, so we're going to learn together as a team. Zara did get a graduation gift, and those who know her say the community is now getting a gift, too. I was so proud and proud of my staff for recognizing her potential, uh, proud of the police department for recognizing that a shelter dog could do um, all this wonderful work for the, the, the community. And they got to help a dog, but then she gets to turn around and help the community which uh, is just a lovely story. Christian Escobar says he just wants Zara to like her new job. I hope she has a good time at uh, here and I hope she catches the bad guys. Officer Escobar says even as they begin patrolling together, he and Zara will keep training too. But he says they don't have to work on their bond. He is 100% confident that no matter what happens, his new partner will always have his back. Sometimes our life depends on these dogs, and so we do have a stronger bond, I would say, than other people. And, um, you know, that's the one thing with this dog that I know that if we got into a fight, she would never leave my side. She'd be in it till the end with me, so. Go shelter dog. Yes. I love that. Uh -huh. And that was Fox 5's Jennifer Davis reporting. Uh, people at the Alexandria Police Department say it's really rare for a shelter dog uh, to rise through the ranks like this. In fact, no one can remember it happening there any time in recent history. Yeah, you always see like German shepherds mm -hmm. and particular type of dogs that are used for right. the particular type of uh, like finding drugs mm -hmm. or chasing people down. Interesting. Zara showing something different. I love mm -hmm. that.